sense of your unique physiology. Here we go. Good. That's, that's the fundamental thing we're looking for. If this line here goes flat, that's when we start to get slight concern. No one will be more concerned than yourself, obviously, but we'll have some concern for you. This is just pulse wave. Yep, so that's obviously an important indicator, strong and healthy as we'd expect. Well, that's good. It means the two are connected, which is also useful in trading. Not always, not always, but, but useful. Now, here's what's interesting for us. If I actually, can you, you see it on the screen there? So what we're seeing here is physiology in real time. So we're measuring emotional state in real time. And it's called biofeedback. Yeah? So we're getting feedback on the biology of the trader. Now, every time we get an up movement in the chart, that's adrenaline going into the system. That's what gets the system going. Gives a heart beating, gives us energy to do things. And every time it comes down, <coughs> excuse me, that's called acetylcholine. It's the opposite of adrenaline, it's the body's relaxation chemical. So we're getting this kind of experience of acceleration and deceleration. Now, in the normal conditions, and you, you, you're doing very well, by the way, obviously under some mild stress, the body accelerates and then it decelerates. Much like being in a car, nice and smooth. But under stress and pressure, as we get more angry or anxious or worried or fearful, what starts to happen is the body tries to accelerate whilst also braking, and we call that state chaos. Yeah, so that's a scientific term. So The sharper the peaks and the bigger the peaks, generally the more stress the person's under and the more smooth it begins to look. So we kind of hear a bit of anxiety at the beginning, all settled down, I'm still alive, which is good, I'm not flatlined, which is good. Yeah. Red line, nothing to worry about. That's just by the EP source connection. And we get a nice sort of smooth bit of data there. Now what I'm curious about is how good your singing is. Sing? Singing. How good is it? You're good at singing? Terrible. Okay, great. That means you'll be the perfect person for this task. <laughs> <laughs> Can we plug our ears? We do anything you want. Okay, so what's your favourite song? <laughs> <laughs> so it's interesting that even under mild psychological stress, uh, we can get obviously significant reaction. Yeah, so we're not going to make you sing, by the way. So that's no, not for you; it's for us. It's, not, it's for us. We're heeding your warning. So we can see that under the thought of having to sing, not singing itself. So the stress didn't come from having to sing. The stress has come from the thought of having to sing. And I didn't say you were going to have to sing, I just asked how his singing was. Yeah? So, there's an interpretation of that event, which then comes into massive amounts of adrenaline going into the system, and we can see the difference on the chart. And now, so that could be like, you know, you're in, a, in a trade situation, you're under stress and pressure, we get the adrenaline going in, through there we might take some action, but at some point, we start to naturally calm down again. 